Welcome back one and all to Let's Play Mass Effect 2. Um, in the last video, we went to Omega, went to the afterlife, uh, talked to Arya, got information about Archangel and the Doctor Morden Solus, and we went into the plague section of the city to go and find Morden. I also died twice. Uh, that was embarrassing. But hopefully it won't happen anymore. So, let's actually talk to Mr. Morden Solus this time. He's not in this room. So let's just take everything in here. This might be useful. I'm a jail capacity. No, Medi jail. Too many gels. Here he is. Professor Morton Solis. Hmm. Don't recognize you from there. Too well armed to be refugees. No mercenary uniform. Quarantine still in the back. Here's something else. Fortune, crew to clean them up, what? Fortune is simply not a cause. But wait, investigating possible use of fire weapon. No, 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 no. God, take a breath. I came here to find you, okay? I'm Commander Shepard. I'm on a critical mission, and I need your help. Mission? What mission? No, 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 no. Two See, days. isn't he Three awesome? Plane spreading too fast. Who's that? Ever heard of an organization <laughs> called Cerberus? Cross paths, I think. Thought they only worked with humans. Why request celerity? I'm on a mission to shut down the collectors, and I need your help. Collectors? Interesting. Play kidding these slums, you say to me. Collectors one of two groups with technology to design. Our goals may be similar. But must stop play first. Already have cure. Need to distribute it at environmental control center. Forge a guardian. Need to kill them. <laughs> what? I'd like to ask someone for help and hear them say, sure, let's go. Right now. No strings attached. <laughs> that would be excellent. Then that would make this game very short. Fortune shut down the environmental systems. Trying to kill everyone. Need to get power back on before he's been suffocates. Here, take my cure. Also, call us a good faith weapon from dead blue sun's marks. They come in handy against Fortune. One more thing, Daniel, one of my assistants. When you deport to territory, looking for victims. As he come back. The doctor doesn't have much chance against the Fortune of Horror. You shouldn't have sent him. Huh. Hmm. Stabber. Told him not to go. Odds of survival low. Huh? He's smart. Careful. Bright future. I hope. <laughs> Any idea where I can find Daniel? No. Heard infected battalion was trapped behind Borcha lines. Daniel went to hell. Warned him not to go too dangerous. Patients here need to get stuck out anyway. Wanted to find him myself. Can't leave the clinic. Have to look after the patients. Let's head for the environmental plane. Ooh. A hand cannon, you say? Uh, so, that was Morden Solus. He is probably one of the most interesting characters. Uh, the there's something right in front of you that I wanted yes. to pick up. Was there? Nope, that's just a Terrian. Alright. Uh, there, there are some interesting little quirks to him. His, his loyalty mission is especially good. And... I don't know, he's just funny. This clinic is a sanctuary. It's really cool. That's my shotgun. That might be a bad idea. Huh. Enemies in front. Well, gosh, if you're going to yell out and just go try to attack them, then might as well, too. This hand cannon. I like this thing. Down. Oh wait. Come on, stop using your shit. Oh wait. Okay, no, it is not safe to charge over there, because there are clearly more than one enemy, so I'm not going to do it. 
I'm out of ammo. Pull him towards me. Or you. Hi there, buddy. You wanna whoop? Someone else over here? Oh, don't have any ammo. Okay, so if I see this other guy, I'm gonna charge into him because now. Fuck are you? Down for him. Honk. And he's dead. More people? Okay. Oh gosh. Uh, warp. Warp, warp, warp. Oh gosh, no ammo. Haha! What? Why? I'm not even. I'm not even playing Modern Warfare. up there. I think you know what I'm going to do now. No, no, no. I want to do this. I want to do this. It's mine. Fuck you. Whoever killed him. That was my kill. Damn it. <laughs> Alright, bank terminal. More hacking. This one? Um, none of these? Come on. Come on. There we go. So the Oscars are on tonight. But since I only have a week to beat this game, this entire game, mind you, um, I'm going to be skipping them, which is a hard thing for me to do because I don't want anyone to just run up to me and say, Hey, did you watch the Oscars tomorrow? Knowing that I am one of the biggest... Well, one of the biggest movie fans at my school, and just to have people just be like, Oh, you didn't watch the Oscars? You're dumb. So, that was a very simplified version of what might happen if I didn't watch the Oscars. Woohoo! <laughs> Let him live, I let you leave. Kill him, I do the same to you. Let him go. You got what you wanted, dude. Be free to go. Uh-uh. Uh. You won't shoot me in the back as soon as I turn around. <laughs> oh, gosh. Oh, yes! <laughs> Yeah, right, like he's gonna care. Psh. Ammo. Wait. Yeah, reload. Then take it. Did we just come through here? No, no, we didn't. God damn it, what are you doing? Look it down. Uh, nothing.
Kala hops. Alright, I think we're supposed to go down. But I can't remember. Did we come from over here? We must have. Alright, fuck it. I right, fuck it. So yeah, the Oscars. I suppose I'll talk about them a little bit. Uh, is anyone else completely pissed about there being one open spot for Best Picture? And it... Whoa, shit. Whoa, shit. It not go... It isn't going to... You know, any of those... Any, like, Drive could have gotten it. Uh, Girl with the Dragon Tattoo. Oh, fuck. Come on. Come on. Pop your fucking head out. Is he dead? Hey. Oh, shit. Okay, get down. Buddy, what was that about killing me? Uh, is there any? Yep. Oh, of course, there's more people. Oh shit! Shockwave, motherfuckers! Spoke the canister behind him. God damn it. Yes. Bastards. Oh wait, gotta reload this thing. Uh, Dragon Tattoo didn't get nominated for Best Original Score, which is a fucking shame. Which I, I also don't understand because Trent Reznor won... 2010, was it? Yeah. Fuck. You won 2010. And this score, arguably, is even better than uh, Social Network. Don't know what you're thinking, Academy. Don't know what's wrong with you. Um, nominating two things for uh, Best Original Song. I don't even... I can't even fucking contemplate how that works. Like, I, I don't get it at all. I mean, the Muppets song is gonna win, because the Muppets is, the Muppets was awesome, I don't give a fuck what anyone says. It was, it was really cool. Or not, not cool, cool's the wrong word, it was funny. It did his job. It's a Muppet movie, goddammit. But, um, but dumb. And then there was a song from Rio, which I didn't I didn't see, but it can't possibly be better than Man or Muppet. So, what else am I angry about? Think so, I think some of the things for makeup and special effects were lacking. So, whatever. I don't like this part. 
I think this is going to be really tough on Vetter. That's a vortum, by the way. Oh, get down. Uh, this one's probably gonna be. Come on. Why is he not getting hurt by that? Get down. Okay, so let's grab our ammo, and then we'll save, because what the fuck, we can't save? Are you, are you kidding me? That's got to be a fucking joke. This is not going to go well. It's really not going to go well. So I'm going to play it uber cautious. So I'll see you all on the flip side, but not really, because we're just going to do this right now. Oh, that was, that's not cool. <laughs> Fuck you. Where? <laughs> if I get shot at all, I'm just going to be saying, Fuck you. Stop being scorpion, Jacob. Wait, is everyone, like, dead or something? Can I save now? Fuck you. Oh god. Why did you why did you pull the guy that was almost dead? Okay, wait. Hold on. In midair, motherfucker. Alright, now. Let's get back into here. Can I save? No, of course. Yeah, this is where it gets... This is where this part gets to be a total bitch. I mean, fuck, look at all those guys over there. Oh, this thing is going to help us quite a lot, I think. Get out of the fucking way, Miranda! And then there were two. It would have been cool if there was one, but you know what? I will deal. I will deal with two. Is there another guy over here? No? I'm not complaining. I ain't complaining. Looking for more ammo. This is a cool moment, though. I like the fact that it's all the wind's all blowing in your face. Oh shit! Yeah, now we get just fucking barraged with rockets. Get your face down. No get. Oh fuck! Come on. Um, slam. Thank you for the ammo, too. I just want those guys to die. Shockwave. Here we go. Can you 
be dead. Please tell me he's dead. You better cover. Take a move. Sorry. One of them dead now. Okay. There's still some motherfucker shooting rockets at us. Yep. I spy, bitch. I don't have any more ammo. Why the hell not? Get back, get back, get back, get back. I just want to do that because I wanted to prove that I wasn't being a pussy in this part. Come on, motherfucker. Come on, motherfucker. Come on, motherfucker. Is there anyone else? Thank you. I think we've done it. Unless more people come out of this door. Yes. We didn't even get close to dying. Excellent. That was intense. Very glad we did not die. So, now all that remains to be done is talk to Morden, go back to the ship, and then uh, we'll land back on uh, Omega. And then, what the fuck are you doing, Miranda? Uh, Italians tortured you would have killed you. Right to kill them. Professor, how can you say that? You're a doctor. You believe in helping people. What the fuck is going on in the back? Sometimes Miranda, sometimes calm the fuck down. Either way, guys, go check on the patients. Lots of work to do. Think about what I said. <laughs> Good kid, bit naive. He'll work. Not even take over the clinic. Should be able to handle it now that George has gone. I know my part of the bargain, Professor. Now you need to do the same. Yes. Don't threaten him or anything like that, Shepard. That's, that's low. Just need to finish up here at the clinic. Won't take long. Be with your ship. Looking forward to it. We're done here. We're heading now. See you on the Normandy. So now we get the tech lab and the med bay. Level 5. Vision summary. Card effects hand cannon. Assault rifle damage. All that good stuff. I believe now I'll be able to talk about uh, what those elements give us, like Ezo and Palladium, all that stuff. Welcome to the ah, first we have a little debriefing. Cerberus working with aliens. Unexpected. Elusive man branching out, that is. Not so human centric. You're very well informed. Solarian government well connected espionage experts had top level clearance once. Retired now. Still, here things. Informed of thing only. No knowledge of man behind it. Anti alien reputation listed as problematic. <laughs> Solarians specialize in secret agendas. I'd expect you to understand Cerberus looking out for human interests. Collectors are abducted, even colonists out on the fringes of terminus space. Mm, not simple abductions wouldn't need me for simple. Entire colonies disappear without a trace. No distress signals are sent out. There are no signs of any kind of attack. There's virtually no evidence that anything unusual happened at all. Except that every man, woman, and child is gone. Gas, maybe. No, spreads too slow. You don't have to sit there and gas. We collected samples from one of the colonies. Oh, fuck, why'd I do that? <laughs> Anytime I see those prompts, I'm just like, oh, boom! But that was Paragon. Fuck. Wow. 
Who's that? I don't know. Synthesized voice. Is it like an emotional reflection screen? No. Maybe. Have to ask. Is that an AI? This ship is equipped with an artificial intelligence. An AI on board? Non-human crew members? Severus more desperate than I thought. The collectors have taken tens of thousands of colonists. We'll do whatever we have to do to find and stop them. Yes, of course. Can't risk being captured like colonists need to identify and neutralize technology. Need samples. Which way to the lab? Follow me, Professor. Excellent. New team member. That's good. So, we'll go talk to him. And the rest of our crew, I guess. But first, the research terminal. Hmm, we'll do that one later. I have weapon ammo. I have a lanch. And why can't I do that yet? One more heavy weapon ammo upgrade. Okay. Weapon upgrade, assault rifle damage. Okay. Uh, so basically, as you can see at the bottom, it says iridium required 2,500. Uh, current iridium uh, 54,000. 54, those basically allow us to do uh, to make upgrades to our uh, weaponry or, or various other things like you saw in the prototype area we can do advanced training which gives us another ability of uh, one of our teammates uh, usually the ones that they earn through their loyalty missions which is why you go on and do those loyalty missions so they can get upgrades and you can get an upgrade uh, but we'll wait to do that before uh, after after we do some of those loyalty missions because right now there won't be anything available and we'll have wasted 5,000 element zero. It's called Ezo. That's what people, well, in universe, that's what it's called. Oh, uh, why not? Missile launcher, armor upgrades, many gel capacity. Yeah, playing through this game already gives us a lot of those uh, resources. So, yeah, it's good to work on those. Uh, these ship enhancements are useful for actually going through the Omega-4 relay. They'll give you a lot of stuff that makes the uh, suicide mission, makes it so that your entire party survives, uh, which basically means you have to gather a lot of these minerals and stuff before you go on the suicide mission if you want to have the best ending. And this will just show you the upgrades you've already gotten. So, now we'll talk to Morton. Yeah. How can I help? Have you got a minute to talk? Of course. Play on Omega dealt with plenty of time to analyze collector intelligence. Impressive laboratory setup. Missed working for operations with a budget. AI in particular. Very helpful. Best setup I've seen since work with special tasks group. Is your assistant Daniel settling in all right? Quite well. Safe and secure. Neighborhood mostly quiet with plague gone. Left him the security mechs just in case. Can't be too careful. Also tired of mechs. Noisy. Never used them in SCG. Tell me more about the Solarian Special Task Group. Respected organization. Clandestine. Handles difficult assignments with limited oversight. Recon analysis. Occasional wet work. Identify problems. Have neutralization options ready should need arise. Model for Council Spectre based on Special Tasks Group. Hmm. Very similar. Similar in what way? Solarians lack numbers. Brute strength. Military prowess. Have to rely upon stealth. Intelligence. Agents trusted given wide operative freedom. Factor similar. Get a goal, told to accomplish. Better, funded, of course. Didn't have to buy our own weapons. Huh. It must have been frustrating working on Omega with such a limited facility. Nope. Loved it. Limited facility presents challenge. Save hmm. the greatest number of people using limited resources. The greatest so, enemy the art the enemy of art is an absence of limitation. Limit. Or some wells, limit. motherfuckers. Stretch the villages to limit. Couldn't have asked for more. Also, enjoy saving people, of course. Helping the helpless, greater good, all that too. Nice. Retirement after SDG work complete. You said you were in the special tasks group. What kind of research were you doing? Not simply research. Several recon missions. Covert, high risk, served under young captain named Purity. Ah, uh, Purity! Page took water, tissue samples from broken colonies. He died in our playthrough. That's a, that's unfortunate. I worked with an SDG captain named Purity. His team helped me destroy a service flooding facility on Burma. Heard Kiri died in Burma. Sad. Still managed to take out the facility. Good captain. Dedicated. 
That will end our conversation. Cool. Let's go talk to Jacob. Shepard, stop looking at that wall. Certainly are. Damn it! Why'd it come up at that moment? Whatever. I've noticed for a second there that Shepard has the creepiest smile in existence. So hopefully we'll see more of that. Uh, I don't want to go that way. Since Kasumi and Zaid are DLC characters, they usually don't have much to say, especially between missions, they won't add anything. Uh, eventually I'll go talk to Zaid once we get more members down in the basement. So. So I think we'll just talk to Miranda, and then I'll fly us to Omega, and then we're done with this video. Yeah. See over here, isn't she? Yeah. What? You seem capable of defending yourself. Why did you need servers? My father invested a great deal in his dynasty. It wasn't a matter of just leaving. I knew he would continue to pursue his investments. I assume that Cerberus grew with your enhanced abilities? Of course. Cerberus fully endorses anything that advances the cause of humanity. Genetic alterations included. But unlike my father and his own selfish reasons, Cerberus and the elusive man believe in a greater good. They see the bigger picture. And I feel like I have a purpose here. You talk about yourself like you're just a tool to be used. By your father? By Cerberus? Maybe. I like to know where I fit in the world. It helps me find meaning in how I was created. You are who you are, man. You don't need to make excuses for it. That's easy for you to say. We've both been engineered for greatness, Shepard. The difference is you were great before we were built you. I'm great because of it. Your spirit and personality are what make you great. It's what makes anyone great. That's kind of you. 
pretty much don't have a reason. But I'm just trying to, I'm, I'm, I'm kind of racking my brain right now to see if I can figure out how, Anytime. why they chose the name Cerberus for the, for the organization. I never thought about it before. Because, like, a three-headed dog guards a certain section of hell. Hmm. I can't think of anything. And he Cerberus guards the elusive man. Is the elusive man the devil? Man, new message at a private terminal. Fuck yeah! Healing your facial scars. Uh, there's something that you can get in the tech lab that lets you heal the scars on your face, but we're not going to do it because we're renegades and we're badasses. So, uh, back to Omega. It's not like we ever really left, but whatever. I think we were just sitting out in deep space. I didn't know they showed this cutscene every time he went. It's interesting. Jacob powers the least, and I want to have Morton on this job, so that's my, that's how I decided to do that, and I just got Jacob's ability, and now I can't use anything else, god dang it, Darka. incinerate cryoblast, I think we want neural shock, at least, wait, what, oh, it has to be loyal. Okay. Hmm. Yeah, I'll just upgrade both of these all the way. Miranda, two points. Let's upgrade warp. I have to make sure that all these are right. Yes, Carnifex. Yes. Yeah. Okay. Everyone else should have the right things, too. Okay. So, back on... Back on... Back on Omega. Don't know why I couldn't come up with that name. And we'll be back... After the break. So, I'll see you then.